Hi everybody, it's Trish. I'm out here today to talk to you about another mental image. And I know I use a lot of mental imagery, but the reason I do that is because each day we may have a different mindset. So some days I can say, swing the club back with my hands and forward with my arms and it works beautifully. And the next day I might need the mental picture of the toe up, top of the backswing, impact, toe up in the direction of the target and finish. But every day our mental pictures change. So I give you a lot of mental pictures and a lot of mental imagery, but the message is always the same. We swing the club back with our hands and forward it with our arms in the direction of the target. Okay? So today's mental picture is this. Do you remember when you were a kid and you had a wagon and you took that wagon and you would pull that wagon? You remember that? Now what part of my body just moved? You see that? So my body is moving. My core, my sternum is moving to pull that wagon. So is that an effective move in the golf swing? Pulling my body. Has the golf club moved? Not really. The golf club hasn't changed in relationship to my body. So what image do I want to have today? Take that wagon, you see, and instead of pulling it with your body, take that wagon and fling it with your arms. Does that make sense? You're going to have the wagon back here and I want to whip that wagon around me. Whip it around me. You see that? So now what happened? My arms whipped it around in the direction that I wanted the wagon to go. So now in the golf swing, if I whip that wagon around me, my arms are moving the club forward. Does that kind of make sense? Just another mental picture for you. So here we go. When we swing the club, we swing it back with our hands and forward with our arms in the direction of the target. So we're going to get set up in center and balance like we always do. And then I want to swing the club back with my hands and I want to whip that wagon around me with my arms. Make sense? All right, here we go. Let's give it a shot. Eh, not quite, not quite. I got a little bit of pull in that wagon. So let's give it another shot. So when I whip that club around, I wanna make sure, or when I whip that wagon around, I wanna make sure that that wagon goes out in front of me. This golf club goes out in front of me. All right, let's give it one more try and see what happens. I'm gonna swing it back with my hands, forward with my arms in the direction of the target. There it was. That was the golf swing we were looking for. So, in other words, whatever mental picture works for you for that particular day is what you need to use. I'm just here to offer you a whole bunch of mental pictures so you can choose which one works for you. Until next week, keep it in the short grass. Have a great day.